Hello, or hey, as we say in Swedish. This is Malin Vigor from Sweden with my first of many to come videos for Manor House Creations. Uh, this video is super fun, super easy, and super quick. Um, I never leave the house without a flower in my hair. So, um, I used to buy them. But I've realized I only need some mist and some pretty flowers, pretty white flowers, like the ones you got, can get from Manor House Creations, and uh, a hair clip. Uh, so in this video I will just show you how I used uh, three different colors to color my white flower. and. Um, then some embossing and adhering to a hair clip and voila! Can you see this? It's so pretty. Right? Mm -hmm. It's super super pretty. So I have chosen this pretty flower. It's all white and ready to get some color. I actually don't know what I'll be wearing while teaching, but um, I know my favorite combinations of colors are pink, green and orange. So, so I would probably use these colors together. Um, some aqua would be good, but I don't think I can use four. Anywho, flower, super fun, super easy. Um, I want to show you this before. If you take a closer look, you can see there's some fabric and netting of some sort. This will... Um, some mists will not take to the fabric as well. Um, and. Um, when you use your heat gun, it will melt somewhat and uh, uh, curl up a bit. Uh, so you have to figure out if you like that look or if you should set it to dry without using a heat gun. You could always do that, but it, I don't have the patience to wait so long. So, well, I just go ahead and mist. To be sure, your flower is all covered and this will be seen from, from the side. So I have to turn it around and do the back as well. Getting on this. Oh, this is pretty. I might leave the orange out, just go with the green and pink because I will be wearing my green apron which I will be misting as well and the back and just getting the mist everywhere like that super fun super easy uh, I will probably want some uh, more bling <laughs> to this so I will dry this with a heat gun because I like the curled look and then I will add some um, embossing to this as well hang on I should also let you in on a secret, or not a secret, you should always try to hold your flower with a tweezer or some sort of tool while using your heat gun because it's pretty easy to burn your fingers 
if you're doing like me. So don't do it like that at home. Uh, some embossing. I would like some extra bling to my edges. So I just ink them up randomly. You have to be careful. And you could use, we have a silver pad, but you can have the clear one or which one you like. And just one thing I always say when I create is I don't like to have too much control. And creating is like having no control at the same time as you do. <laughs> you cannot, you know what color you see want and you know. Mm, I would like it somewhat like this, but you never really know how it will end up like when you drop it on the floor and end up everywhere. So I'm just set this aside. Sorry. So, and now again, um, tweezer would be good. Oh. Can you, does it show on the camera? Don't think it does. Oh, yeah. to get this in my hair then well I need a hair clip of some sort so I will be getting that hang on I have a pink hair clip to adhere this on and I would use some liquid adhesive to get this on because glue dots isn't really as effective if, if you want it to, to hold. But for now, voila! Mm -hmm. 